First, Lego League is a program that engages children in playful and meaningful learning while helping them to discover the fun in science and technology. It's a global program with a presence in 80 countries. Tournament director for the first Lego League Trinidad and Tobago, Terence Carew, told us what was expected of the teams. So they get to design a robot using Lego, which they have to uh, accomplish uh, 15 missions on a board. These missions, they would have time to practice some weeks before because we give them the same missions. Um, so they have enough time to design their robots to suit. Some teams may compete all missions, some compete complete all. However, this they have three rounds, which we use the highest score uh, that they accumulate. Aside from the robotics, Mr. Caruso and the teams are also given a research project where they have to come up with a problem in their community, as well as an innovative way to solve it. So there is a lot of interest that is shown, especially with Lego robotics, because kids, they grew up from small playing with Lego. Now, um, the actual tech side of it, um, which is the robotics, to know that they grew up and there is a side where they can actually build a, robotic, uh, a robot from toys that they were playing with from kids. So it brings out that interest in them. Also, those who like programming and coding, it brings out, it actually gives those students an opportunity to bring out their skills and develop it also. The program utilizes theme-based challenges to engage children in research, problem solving and engineering. Each annual challenge has three parts, the project, the robot game and core values. Working in teams of up to 10 children and guided by at least two adult coaches, team members were given approximately 10 weeks to complete the challenges. Additionally, the teams presented the core values of how they worked in the 10-week journey. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.